What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I wasn't coming out here to shoot a video, like, at all. I was coming out here just to grab water with Crystal. Um, but I got some time to kill, because she has got a meeting right now on she's on the phone. So, I am just kind of not quite hanging out on the side of the highway. But, I mean, pretty darn close, because the highway's right there. <laughs> Oh, I love coming out here, though, man. Favorite, one of my favorite places in the whole wide world. And it's funny because um, in the city we were both feeling aggravated, anxious, uh, just we almost decided to turn around and say, "Screw it." The more out of the city we got, the uh, the better we started to feel. And now that we're both out here, it's like, <sighs> yes. The last few years for me have been a lot of flux and a lot of change. Uh, people coming into my life, people leaving my life, and I've always been. Eh. When it comes to dealing with change, not dealing so well, you know what I mean? But, um, I've been trying to embrace the being uncomfortable because it, it forces you to grow. So, that's kind of what I've been trying to do. And I don't regret it. Because the people that are meant to stay in my life will be in my life, and they will stay, you know what I mean? And the people who left, well, it's all part of the journey, right? Maybe they come back, maybe they don't. So far, the people that have decided to take off, I don't need them to come back. I don't want them to come back. It's all about finding that sense of belonging, even when you're happy on your own and content and you find peace within solitude having belonging and, and having just someone you can talk to even it's great and a lot of the time us as, especially as guys uh, we have a hard time talking about our feelings and and we really shouldn't because I mean we're human all the same. So you know it's part of the the uh, part of the journey too is is being a better version of yourself. I don't know. I'm rambling now. <laughs> I'm just uh, Do I gotta go back to work on Wednesday? Do I gotta? Can I just Get a hotel room and stay out here tonight. <laughs> I mean, if I have my camping gear. But I don't. The camping trip for me was... Um, it, it was definitely a step towards that, finding that, that belonging. Um, even though I don't have a van yet and... I don't know when I will... Um, you know, I've been accepted by this community and uh, by the, I mean, everybody there, and I've made some new friends. And uh, yeah, I'm just really excited to see where, I, where life goes. You know, June was such go 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 go, which I you know I still have videos from the beginning of June I got to put together, which by now you probably would have seen. <laughs> Um, yeah, I do like spending time on my own, it's true, but I like this community more. And once I get my van, it's going to be, oh, I just can't wait. Hmm. Never ever get tired of that view. I'm 
was just out here last week. <laughs> All right, let's. Uh, I'll cut to the water. The uh, the, the where we're getting water. I'll cut to that next. Booyah, still here. All right, grab another bottle. Oh my god, YouTube, look what I found. It's a rare crystal spotting. Yeah! <laughs> Earlier I was talking to the camera just about finding a sense of belonging, as we had talked about before, and how in solitude it's a good thing to find a community of people you can belong to. Just kidding. <laughs> yes, belonging. That's right, we belong to the earth. We have to remember that we are mostly made of water so we need to talk to the water around us and ask the divine energies that are in it the goddesses the divas of the water to attune the water in us to that of a higher frequency so that we can get rid of our toxins and get rid of our stress just like how the river alchemizes that for the earth how yeah. is that for belonging that's belonging I was saying how cr how cranky we both were on the way out here, but how we're just like, woo, now. Yeah. <laughs> 10 miles out of the city and I was a whole other woman. Oh. One thing I really like about this spot is the water always comes out of the ground. So damn cold and <laughs> ready to drink. <laughs> All right. I think the jugs are done. Don't think I injured my shoulder this time. Now I'm going to fill up my jugs. My... Just these ones here. Oh, and then we're gonna head into town to grab a bite. Don't know where yet. Uh, in the comment section down below, those who have been to Canmore, leave me your suggestions on places to eat next time I come out here. See, the thing is, is, when you don't plan to film a vlog, you don't bring all of your equipment. i.e. no tripod to make this shot easier and to make my foot less wet. Woo! Oh, I almost fell down. Guess I could just stand it if I'm like an idiot. Come on now. I didn't just almost fall. <laughs> You're kidding. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know either. We've just lost the lid for the fruit. We just lost the lid for the fruit. Will the news just be upset? They may or may not be. Is there wrath? Like, is there a wrath? We're about to find out. <laughs> <laughs> How was your burger? fucking good. Yeah. Darn doggy good for sure. They never disappoint me there. Nope. Look at that view. Yes, I do believe I hear a boat. <laughs> sure did. Which way? Okay. Onward and upward. Other than downward and backward. Yeah. She floating. Hating. 
I don't know the words from here. <laughs> Riding dirty. <laughs> True. Enjoy the concert. Oh, <laughs> wow. That's like perfect. If I fuck this up. Oh, the light. I didn't realize the light wasn't on my phone. <laughs> Now I'm going to have to find some bleeps to put over that. <laughs> What's that expression? You lost the game? Yeah. I don't know. I think I might be skipped out for the night. You did your best. Done. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.